Hey guys, it's Ange here with Beauty Unpacked and I wanted to share with you uh, one of my recent purchases that I made and I was very, very excited to find this bag um, through our good friends uh, from Opulent Habits. Uh, it is a luxury consignment store based in North Jersey. Our friends Darcy um, owns it and she has a ton of beautiful pre-loved bags, some that are new. And when she posted this on Instagram, which you have to follow her, she has a very, very large um, inventory of luxury bags, including Birkin bags, Chanel bags, you know, you name it, she has it. So I follow her Instagram page every single day to the point where it's quite addicting. And I had um, contacted her about a classic flap bag. And when she posted this bag, I said, you know what? I have to have it. So I wanna share with you my review and also um, the details of this beautiful bag. So the Chanel bag that I purchased is the medium cocoa top handle bag in the caviar leather with the antique hardware. And when I first got this, I thought maybe like the hardware was a little dull um, or it wasn't polished. So when I emailed um, Olivia over at Opulent Habits and I just wanna let you know that they are very quick in, in responding and their customer service is A plus. So you know, if you're uh, on the hunt for a luxury bag, consider pre-loved. And um, like I said, when I contacted them and said, hey, I think my hardware is dull, they assured me it is actually antique hardware. So I just wanna show you how beautiful the bag is. And the bag itself has this removable handle, okay? And of course it has this beautiful top handle. The size is extremely practical. So I'm gonna go through all those details. I recently just got back from a trip to Greece and I stopped in London. This was my only purse that I carried with me and it absolutely carried everything in my bag and I'm going to put all those things in the bag for you just to see how much stuff that it carries. So when you purchase any bag noted um, by Opulent Habits or any pre-loved site, you know, you wanna make sure that they have the appropriate um, documentation and definitely this bag did. And also when they post the bag, they do tell you whether or not it comes with the box, the dust bag and all the authenticity cards. So my bag came with the authenticity card so you could see so it's series 27 which means it was manufactured in somewhere 2019 so i'm cool with that and also they did supply the original tag in the bag so i thought that that was really really nice that made me feel really good um also with the bag itself it came with this beautiful Chanel Iconic box and also the beautiful Camellia flower, which I think is nice with the ribbon. And inside is the booklet. There's a huge booklet that comes with it. Um, and they packaged it so nicely. The sh original Chanel tissue paper is in here. So I definitely felt like uh, a, a true princess receiving this beautiful box in the mail. So I'm going to go over some details with you uh, about the measurements of the bag. And if this bag is um, perfect for you. So the reason why I like larger bags, especially like this, um, I do travel a lot. And also I like to fit a lot of things in my bag, including sketchbooks, or my tablet because I blog a lot. So I like to have my, my iPad in here. Also, I have my um, day planner. So 
depending on um, what's what's going on in my week, I like to have my bag stocked the way I like. So I'm gonna go over some measurements with you. So first thing, the top handle. So it is called the Coco Top Handle, and the top handle is a nice size, especially for the inside of your wrist or in the hook of your arm. It's about three and a half inches from top to the beginning of the bag, which I like. And also it has the beautiful long strap. And the long strap, that's about 19 and a half inches. So you definitely can wear this as a crossbody or you can just wear it over your shoulder. So something I really do recommend is, you know, especially the older that we've gotten, you know, speaking for myself, I prefer a crossbody bag that I could also wear uh, definitely over my wrist. So when I'm walking around, I like to drape the handle this way. And then of course, when I am going through the airport or even going to work, whatever it may be, I like to have the handle up. So a couple other things with the bag itself, it's about 10 inches long. So that's pretty, pretty nice size. 10 inches, 13 and a half inches wide. So you have a lot of space. And also you have five and a half inches with the bottom. Another great feature, they have little feet. So especially when you are resting it somewhere or if you have it on the table, it doesn't get uh, messed up, especially the leather. So another feature with the bag, if you could see it, you could see here that there is the little Chanel logo here, which I think is adorable. The really nice caviar leather. And then also right here, you could see the original Chanel, like the, just the Chanel information, the little logo here. So there's a lot of great features with this bag. On the back is the smile pocket. So I tend to use this pocket for, again, just gotten back from my trip. I had my passport back here. I had my cell phone back here. Um, if I needed, you know, like, again, like traveling through um, London, I had my little, my little pass in here, so it was great. So definitely very handy. So it is a turn lock, very easy to open. And then inside, a lot of space, a lot of pocket space, a lot of space. So that was very, very important to me, especially again, when purchasing a, a nice luxury bag. I don't like to just use it just for dinner or going out. I like to actually use my bags. Uh, another great little feature. Again, you can see like the metal hardware. So that's really, really nice. So, okay. A lot of things that I packed in this bag, especially going through the airport. I did just get back from Greece with a pit stop to London and I needed something that could carry all my things and also still be stylish, you know, through day to day. So I'm going to show you what I put in my bag. So the first thing I had my tablet. So this is very heavy and I honestly got thought that my bag was going to like break or the strap was going to fall apart. It definitely didn't with this. So with my iPad, I put that in the back so you could see if it's perfect in the back pocket and you can close it. No problem. So I had my iPad. I had my Louis Vuitton Victorian wallet. I had my regular makeup bag. So this is the Louis Vuitton Pachette 19, which is a great size, especially for um, the amount of makeup that you want to carry with you. And I did take some uh, minimal pieces, which I did post on my blog. So you have to definitely check that out at beautyunpack.com. I did not want to get sick, especially um, this time around. So I packed with me some essentials, wet ones, Clorox wipes, you know, you name it. So that went in the back pocket. 
So I just want to show you, there's still a lot of room. My tissues, so that also went in the back. I love carrying a little notebook because I like to jot things down and just to check myself, did I forget anything? And while I was in Greece, I was able to figure out my genealogy tree on my father's side, so I did take a lot of notes. So that is also gonna go in the back. So you can see where I put that. Now, another thing is my cell phone. So I have the iPhone 11 and that fit perfectly. And you could see right now that goes in that little um, empty space. So no problem there. So I'm gonna shut my bag and you're gonna see how it looks. So there is a lot of room here on the side. So I would say next time what I would do is really um, utilize each inch of this bag itself. So definitely it's great. Everything fits in here. So I'm gonna stand up. So you could see that no problems. Let me back up so you could see. So no problems, everything fits great in the bag. Cross body, no problem, I'm 5'3", so the bag was like a perfect size for me. It was chilly, especially uh, this time around in Greece and in London, so I was wearing my coat, I was wearing multiple layers, and the bag was not a burden at all. It was not heavy, it was just enough. I mean, it's ideal because it is leather, so there is gonna be a little bit of a weight with the bag, but it wasn't overbearing. Um, so if you do consider getting a perfect bag that you can wear to work, that you could wear for the weekend, uh, if you are a mom, it's a great bag because you can put you know, your essential things in here for the kids, snacks, if you need to put a diaper or like, you know, like a juice box, it'll definitely fit in here. So I really, really like this bag and I hope that my review uh, was helpful to you. And I do encourage that if you do want to purchase a designer bag and cost is just too much, consider pre-loved. Opulent Habits is one site that I 1000% recommend to you. Darcy and Olivia are great to uh, work with, very quick, very responsive, and also they do tell you full details of the bag. They were um, kind enough to tell me, you know, how many owners did the bag have? Because I just wanted to know, like, how many owners did, did this bag, you know, have? Where did it travel to? So, um, that was very important to me. And also, I like to keep my boxes. I just like that. I like the idea of, of having my boxes. And it was just great to have this beautiful Chanel bag with the original box, the original tags. Everything was original. So uh, it felt really, really nice. So that is it. Definitely check out my website at uh, beautyunpacked.com. I am a blogger based out of, uh, outside of Philadelphia, and my website is all about travel, luxury, beauty, and that is all that I post about. So if there's something that you would like for me to blog about, please let me know. You can write it in the comments or you can email me. I'd love to hear from you. You can also follow me on Instagram at beautyunpacked underscore, and there you'll see tons of beautiful photos and also reviews um, of my latest um, luxury obsessions, beauty obsessions and whatnot. So, all right, well, hopefully um, you enjoy the rest of your week. And um, if you have not done so, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and um, share with your friends, especially those that are luxury obsessed and also who love to travel and beauty. So thank you, have a good day, bye.